वेलकम टू क्लास वन ऑनलाइन क्लास बाय सेंट जोसेफ्स एकेडमी आई एम योर मॉरल साइंस टीचर मिस अंशिका माइकल एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू रिवाइज आवर चैप्टर्स टिल वी हैव स्टडीड सो लेट्स स्टार्ट the gift anu is a girl waiting for her father who promised her to take her to the flower show going on in the town these days after waiting for a long her father came and they both depart from home to the way of flower show anu was very excited for seeing different types of flowers in the show after waiting for very long finally anu reached to the flower show and she was very happy to see the beauty variety and the colors of the different kinds of flowers after seeing these flowers anu got sad and asked her father why don't we have these flowers in our garden then father answered her that every flower needs suitable climate and soil for example god gave you life after preparing all necessary things for you like papa and mama god created all living beings and all non living things we should thank god for all that we have and especially for our life because some people does not have life like us this was our chapter 1 what we learn from this chapter we learn that we should thankful to god that he gave us life because many of the people does not have life like us now moving on to the exercise question 1 fill in the blanks dash to here what we use to hear we use our ears so ears to hear likewise what we use to see we use eyes to see dash to clap hands to clap legs to walk mouth to sing nose to smell next answer the following questions question 1 who gave us everything and the answer of this question is god gave us everything Question two: What is God's most precious gift to you? And the answer of this question is: God's most precious gift to me is my life. Now, chapter two. 
वन मॉर्निंग वैन अनु गॉटअप फ्रॉम स्लीप शी रिमाइंड हर मदर्स वर्ड दैट वी शुड थैंक गॉड फॉर ऑल दैट ही गेव अस एंड शी इज स्टार्टेड थैंकिंग गॉड शी थैंक गॉड फॉर पापा मामा ग्रैंड मदर ग्रैंड फादर ब्रदर सिस्टर फ्रेंड्स and her sweet home she also decided to tell this to her friends in the school god gave us everything for example mother father grandmother and grandfather brother and sister not only these but many more things god gave us some of them are food to eat clothes to wear etc man created many things but a few things are those which only god can give us like sunlight is not possible without sun and oxygen is not possible without trees man can make furniture with the help of wood but wood will also come by trees which is natural only god can give us trees so basically what i am trying to tell you is that everything we are surrounded by is given by god for what we should thank him because some of the people do not have these things too so what we learn from this chapter we learn that we should always be thankful to god for everything he has given us because many of the people do not have these things in their life now move on to the exercise of this chapter answer the following questions question 1 why should you thank god why should we thank god because he gave us everything so what will be the answer the answer is i should thank god because he gave us everything question 2 who gave you your parents who gave you your parents and the answer is god gave me my parents question 3 who gave you your grandparents and the answer is god gave me my grandparents question 4 who gave you your brother or sister and the answer is god gave me my brother and sister Question 5 What did Anu thank God for Anu daily thank God So what is the things Anu thank God for Anu thank God for mama papa grandfather grandmother brother and sister Question 6 is complete the sentence When you dash you should thank dash So the answer is when you get up you should thank God for all that God gave you Now let's come to chapter 3 which is home my sweet home Anu's home is at river bank 
and it is very beautiful to look around. There are coconut trees, mango trees, paddy fields, flying birds and butterflies. Anu's home is a sweet home and everybody in her family loves each other. They all talk together, eat together, play together and pray together. Anu proudly says to her friends, My home is a sweet home. God gave us everything, but nature is one of the most important thing in that. Nature includes oceans, rivers, mountains, forests. These were some examples of those things which God gave us. Exercise Answer the following questions. Question 1. What does Anu say to her friends about her home? And the answer is, Anu tells her friends that her home is a sweet home. Question 2. What do Anu's family members do together? Anu's family members talk together, eat together, pray and play together. Question 4. What the Anu's family members are doing? In this picture, what the family members are doing? And the answer is, Papa is drinking, Anu is writing, Mama is cooking and Brother is reading. This was our revision of all the work we have done yet. Now I give rest to my words. We will meet again soon with a new chapter. Till then, stay safe and happy. Thank you.